Thank you, Cahirlach. Leader, a question I asked myself some time ago was, why was the government coalition of Fianna Fáil, Fine Gael and the Greens subjecting the construction industry to lockdown when the UK and every other country in Europe was not? What was the scientific or medical reasoning behind this? What was the empirical evidence to support this construction lockdown? Was it clear that building sites were significant sources of transmission of COVID-19? Were large number of builders and tradespeople flooding our hospitals and ICUs on foot of workplace acquired infections? The answer I thought would surely be, surely be especially given how vital construction to our every, every sector of the Irish economy, what a major source of employment it is, and the dire need to provide housing and infrastructure to people. I thought there must be a cogent, empirical and scientific data to support such me measures. Surely there must be. Well, I have received answers to my questions. The comprehensive answers, backed up by the HSC data, came, for a com came I'm sure to every senator in here, from a correspondence from the Construction Industry Federation dated the 25th of February. HSE evidence shows that our safety protocols effectively prevent COVID-19 from spreading on construction sites. The HSE evidence and our track record demonstrates that industry can operate safely at full capacity. There have been only eight admissions to hospital, of which five to ICU related to construction since September 2020. We have a certain Fianna Fáil senator making frivolous speeches in this House, lamenting on lost opportunities to get the shift. Well, the only lost shift I am concerned about are the ones that provide houses for people in need, shifts that build hospitals and roads, and the shifts that put bread on the table of workers and their families. So I'm calling on the government now to expedite the opening and reopening of the construction industry in this country. Thank you, Cahirla. Senator Kilgan brought up um, her frustrations with regard to uh, construction industry, but just to answer her question that she asked me directly as to why uh, and do we think uh, that construction is a cause for concern, um, I think the response that came after Christmas was that movement and interaction was a cause uh, for the increase and the flow of the virus. It wasn't any specific sector, it was every sector and that's why the entire country was put into lockdown in January. And I know we're all tired and frustrated and we're all going to start probably having conversations in the coming weeks and months about reopening society once the vaccine programme does step up a gear. Uh, but I don't think it's helpful for us to be pitting one section of society against another. The most important section that we needed to reopen was our schools that started last Monday and I wish them continued success and the staff uh, and the teachers in schools to make sure that we manage that and we manage it safely. Um